In previous tutorial, I explained about this part. Now, this tutorial is about add car traffic, basically another one, which is a flow. And also I explained about the intersections, unsignalized and signalized intersections in SOMO. So for the car traffic, uh, I want to add also a flow, which is commonly used in transportation. So now if I click on the vehicle and then here, we have a couple of options. Forget about everything. Just select this flow and then put just left click here it will add some flow here and then the id is f0 and then i'm changing this to gray and then first lane you can change these things and more importantly is volume per hour so this is volume per hour i am changing to 500 to finish road see this gray and now if i go to the edit again open somo gui absolutely not requiring any coding on everything okay and then if i give some delay again right and then run it will show the movements right just zoom out zoom in zoom out see these cars are moving so let's go back again to the net edit so now i'm gonna this time add and intersections here right so go to the network again then see again nodes and this beautiful road right so when this is blue it means that it's already selected so you can just click on it or press escape it will do it just deselect okay so how to create intersections here so first thing is okay i'm gonna just for example, add a, like roads like this, and then it will automatically know. It doesn't automatically change to the intersections, right? So, see, it doesn't have any connections here. So again, how to fix it now? So, okay, so go to this move tool first. Go to this select here, select. The only blue one is this, okay, and then move. Hold left click and then change it to here, right? Okay, so now how to create intersections here? Okay, so again, escape, select mode, escape, right? And then uh, select basically these two, okay? And then left click. Here we need to add to split these edges. So this will split the edge, see? Okay, so now how to find out what what is this basically here, right? So select this connection mode. You will see that these things here, this is a connection between this lane and this lane, right? So what about then that one? Like, is there any connections there as well? So press OK and then select again this one. Escape first, select this one, and then go to the connections. You will see it is only one, right? So then what happens here is basically it didn't make this one as a separate junction. It's just this junction is separate one. If I change it, you see how to make like this link also separated right so for that again okay control z for that uh, again select this time this link and then here okay so what I'm gonna do is this select this one select that one right and then here again go to the edge split edge so this time this is for that one right so if I select this one you will see that so both of them now has that junctions, right? So then how to make these three as a single junctions? That's the next question. So what do you need to do is go here and then deselect this one, select this, 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 and then go processing, join selected 
junctions. It will turn the junctions to the one. Going into the connection, you will see that this nice junctions. So now the question is, let's say if I put the cars, where the cars will go, right? What are the connections basically? Is there any connections? So for that, we need to determine basically how. Again, go here, select this one, go to the connections, and then here there are a couple of informations, right? But doesn't really matter. Just select on one link, left click. You will see this source lane has two green possible target, right? You may select this one, for example, right? And then press OK. This one, this one, press OK, right? This one, this one, press OK. That's it. We have the connections now. So then, uh, so this is the connections. And if I go and see what are the priorities have been applied, I go here, right? Because this is unsignalized intersections. So let's say if I select this one, you will see this has a right of way. The red one. This is yield. So this means that two vehicles, if they approach to this intersection at the same time, this one, then true movement has the priority over this one. Okay? And then uh, also this is the same. Okay, so then uh, I have explained the network. I have explained uh, this select mode, move mode, create, and uh, connections, and then this one. I didn't explain about the traffic. Let's let's do that. The traffic light, uh, traffic signals. So if I click, then you will see nothing happens, right? So for that, click on these junctions and then create select this crate and it will automatically fill something okay so now i need to explain a little bit about uh, how it works how these things works for that go to the edit edit visualizations and then here go to the junctions show link tls index okay so zoom zero one and two right so uh, you will see that what this zero one two means right so if you come here then there are four phases zero one two three right so the phase zero has the duration of 42 seconds and then it's green red green right green red so the zero is green this is red and then the, that one is green so let's go to the next phase. So then it turns to the yellow and this is red, right? Next one, green, red, and yellow. You can modify these things. And then uh, based on your uh, preference or whatever you, you see, for example, in the real world, you have a traffic data, you can come and then modify. And especially for the complex intersections, we have many of these phases. So in transportation, we call these as NEMA phases. Okay. So let's say the true movement, left, right. And then uh, we have, for example, one, two, three, four. So in the intersections, right, located in uh, your home somewhere, right, they have already this type of things coding inside the box for the intersection signalized uh, scheduling. Okay, so then, uh, okay, network demand and data, I have already explained these things very briefly. Okay, so then what do we need to do? Do I need to go every time in open? And then what will happen? I mean, if you see this test here, right? You will see that we have the test.net root and then this, uh, this one, right? Test.somo. Like where this come from, right? So, I mean, if, for example, I just 
close this one right and then I close this one and I didn't I don't have even for example this one right just delete it so go to the edit open right and then it will automatically add so what about these two what are these network so this this is network this root means those demands if we have data then another file will add it right where is the signal signal is inside this row so the reason that i told you to install notepad plus plus is because of this right now so if you don't have these files right so let's say i'm creating test one right test one so now i want to save that network here right good okay so for that just go to the file and then here we have this option save network just save go to the test one right and then this is uh test one don't forget about these things this one and then the second one is this test one right and the third one is the demand right so now those three files are here okay so then if i open it you will see that the network is here and then i can for example put this 200 and then i can apply change to the real world you will see all the cars and they are uh, moving right so but what you see is these cars are coming here and then they are disappearing. Why? Why it's happening, right? For that, if you go to the net edit, select this one, you will see that this car ended here because we have already basically cut down this one, right? So an easy fix is just to delete this demand, right? And then put another demand. Flow and then put it here. So I'm just determining those cars go here, right? and then finish the route okay so if i go then to the sumo or i can go here and then save this time i have the file just save it it will save here then if i run then those cars now will go right 